Welcome to Digital Mind Food as we review a piece of software that is designed to assist in uncovering micro niches. Now a micro niche is a niche item, a product or service that hasn't been tapped into. Something that's really deep. Something that where you take the generic keyword phrase and you break it down to its most targeted form. And this software is designed to bring you information to help you break out into the internet and make money in an industry, product, or service, or whatever it may be, um, that doesn't have a lot of competition but a lot of but but enough demand for you to profit from. So let's dive right into the software and see the different tools and how it works. Because this software does have a lot of tools, we are going to break this up into a few videos. So if you see this one. Um, please be sure to check out the others so you can get a real full view of what this software can offer. Now the first thing we're going to do is a unique tool up here which is called Brainstorm. And what this tool does is it brings back some instant results for maybe possible niches that you didn't even think of. So we're going to click on the Brainstorm key and here it goes as you see here it brings back a bunch of results all different kinds random results and what you can do is you can explore these deeper if any of these tend to catch your eye and dig deeper which dig this button obviously you know speaks for itself to discover whether this niche has been tapped into or not and just to give you familiar with some of the other things that we're looking at here we're looking at the search count now when we go into any particular search phrase it's going to give you the search count for that phrase now this is the monthly searches that people type into major search engines in order to you know find information they want for a particular keyword the exact phrase count is the exact so if you put this in Google and you're looking for this exact phrase it'll show you the um, number of sites that have that keyword that exact keyword phrase um, incorporated in it your ad cost which would be the cost of the ad with something like AdWords your commercial intent now your commercial intent this is what people when they type in a keyword phrase it gives you the percentage of number of um, people that buy in other words if somebody enters in a particular keyword phrase it will show you the percentage of people that actually buy that item and the last section here in this uh, this view right here is the SOC which is also called the strength of competition and what this does is give you a number of sites that are optimized for that particular keyword phrase and it gives you um, a sense of low to high numbers and um, also color coding green would be a possible keyword phrase that you want to pursue because it hasn't been optimized yet but as we go on into the videos um, we'll explore and show you more of this so let's get back to the brainstorming part of this so you can see here they give us a bunch of different options of um, possible niches that we didn't even think of so we can actually dig into this sort of random numbers but um, you know we can click on either one and it'll help us really break it down into even finer terms so let's just grab one let's grab metal detector so we're gonna grab we're gonna go to the dig this now the software has done its search and it's just asking for a uh, Google verification so we're gonna type that in right now and we're going to hit continue. Now when the software is done, we'll be right back. Now as you can see the software has brought back a number of results here in finer terms and as, we, as you can see it breaks it down from high to low and you can adjust that according to clicking and toggling this term here it'll uh, shuffle it back and forth. But it gives you a bunch of different terms that people are looking for. Now these are terms that you may not even ever thought about. But um, normally by a rule of thumb, I don't go any lower than uh, 200 searches a month. So as you can see here, I would probably stop here and work my way up. But you got beach metal detectors. You got bounty hunter detector. I mean, this is all just major keyword phrases that, um, you know, possible niches that you can explore. So let's take a look at what the results gave back. It gave us the search count as explained earlier and it gives us the trend which shows us the trend of that keyword phrase you can see it goes up and down and up again down and up and um, right here it gives you the exact uh, 
phrase count, which we'll explore in the next video, the commercial intent, and the SOC, which we'll explore more in more videos. So as you can see quickly, by using that brainstorm tool and clicking on a niche that you haven't thought of, you can quickly jump into and get finer targeted terms, which are micro niches that you may want to explore. So that's a quick overview of the brainstorm tool and we'll see you in the next video as we explore the exact keyword phrase commercial intent and SOC.